Hey, um, so I'm pretty concerned about Marianne and Will, and I don't have anyone to talk about it to. Marianne is pretty upset whenever I bring up the subject. Margaret really wouldn't understand, and I don't want to bother our mom about it. So I feel kind of embarrassed about that last video. Marianne and I went at it pretty hard. But you saw how she reacted when I brought up my concerns about her behavior with Willoughby. It's just that this relationship is completely different from any that Marianne has been in before. In high school she would date, but it was never for very long, and she didn't seem that committed. I don't know, she, and then she'd break up with them and say that they didn't meet her requirements, whatever that means. But with Willoughby it's a completely different story. I guess my biggest worry about them is just that they're getting attached so quickly and just... Marianne is... she always feels really strongly about things and she is so emotionally invested already and I mean with the dog and the tattoos the tattoos and how much time they've been spending together it's just I don't know, they're becoming that couple that spends all their time together and doesn't talk about anything except for the other person and seems completely unaware of what's going on around them and other people. And that's really unlike Marianne as well. And the strangest part, they don't talk to each other, they don't call each other like boyfriend or girlfriend or say that they're dating. So I don't know if they're just close friends or if they just really don't like labels. And another strange thing, like I said, is how Marianne has been acting. She's just a lot more reckless and inconsiderate than usual, it seems like. Like with the whole tattoo thing, for instance. Normally, Marianne is the kind of person who would think about getting a tattoo, but she would spend months and months agonizing over whether she was going to get one and what kind of design she was going to have and all of that. And, you know, she'd ask our mom and see what she thought. But it's like, along comes Willoughby, and she's like... Oh yeah, I'll go and get a tattoo with you. I mean, okay, I genuinely do like Willoughby. I know it doesn't seem like it, but I do. He's really nice, he's kind, and he's been spending a lot of time with us, so he kind of feels like part of the family. And, you know, he helps Mart with her videos. So that's really great. It's just, we've only known him for like six weeks, and Marianne is already to this point where she's spending the night at his house all the time, and I don't know. Marianne says that it's not the amount of time that you've known someone, but the depth of your feelings for them. I don't know. Seriously. Only six weeks. That's not very long. And something Marianne has never been very good at is looking to the future. I always kind of hoped she would be attracted to a guy who was really ambitious and knew exactly what he wanted to do with his career and his life. But Willoughby, he doesn't seem to really care about the future. He's just very living in the moment and I don't know. I don't know what he wants to do and I mean he spends so much time with Marianne I don't even know how much he's working right now but it doesn't seem like he'd be able to support himself. And it seems to me that if you're in a serious relationship you should have some sort of conversation about the future and what you want to be doing because what if you want completely different things, or your paths diverge, and it's just, you're completely, I don't know, I don't know. I'm, uh, I'm done, I'm done.